It's cruise day, hey everyone, cruising with JT here, and I'm super excited to take you on my first official cruise as a full-time YouTuber. Thank you so much, hello. <laughs> uh, it's gonna be an awesome day, guys, awesome cruise. I'm going to the Alaska for seven nights, and of course, there he is, the beautiful Norwegian Bliss. It's gonna be a great week, guys. Here we go. to hit that like button everyone and if you're not subscribed please do subscribe to my channel and also enable those notifications the experiences for turnaround day are pretty intense you know you have about 4,000 plus people getting off the ship and you have 4,000 plus people getting on the ship right so there's a lot a lot of things happening there's a lot of food supplies you can see all those crates and boxes there they're loading the ship with food so it's pretty intense and of course as you come here you have early baggage drop off here at pier 66 in seattle this is where norwegian docks and uh, you can see right there, 66, early, luggage, early baggage drop off. And then, you know, there's folks getting ready to board. It's pretty exciting. So, um, yeah, it's going to be an awesome uh, cruise day, embarkation day. It's going to be epic. And I uh, can't wait to you guys for the ride. It's going to be awesome. Awesome journey ahead, guys. Here we go. Hey, guys, that was the easiest check-in process ever. Like, literally, my time was 9.30 a.m. to 10 a.m. We got in at 9.30 a.m., checked in, took less than five minutes. And I was like, wow. And here I am in the waiting area. So we're gonna board in probably like an hour or so. So let me keep in mind, even if you have an earlier check-in time with Norwegian, you will probably have to wait in the waiting area to board. But wow, that was the easiest check-in process ever. Gave my passport, my room number, got my card, and here I am. Less than 10 minutes. It was amazing. Like wow, easy, easy. Gotta love it. All right, and here's today's freestyle daily from Norwegian. Again, this is the first edition, day one, Saturday, June 24th of 2023. Feel free to follow the sun instead of a schedule. Welcome aboard Norwegian Bliss. Your vacation has begun. Whether it's your first time cruising with us or your returning guests, get ready for all the freedom and flexibility that cruising with Norwegian has to offer. With a variety of dining options, dazzling entertainment, and exciting onboard activities, there are plenty of ways to make your vacation your own. We have choices of what to see and do and the freedom to do it your way. So I love how Norwegian kicks off their cruises with this daily planner, Freestyle Daily. It basically gives you information, play when you want uh, the mobile app and then of course the dining options as well it gives you an idea as to what's open when during lunch dinner what's complimentary what's extra charge uh, it's awesome right? and of course you got the late night eats right there local bar and grill love it for lunch today i'm definitely gonna be going to the garden cafe to get my taste of india on i love the indian food that they offer and then here you got two nice lineup we got the beatles experience comedy with levity entertainment lots of fun stuff for the kiddos that you want to make sure they get registered uh, registered for special events of course you got to the mentory safety drill and of course you have all the daily activities right so i'll definitely be checking out some of the shows tonight welcome bash party uh let's see that's some stuff in the theater comedy night i'll oh, definitely doing comedy i love my comedy hey guys this is pretty cool i love it and then also on the next page here good to know hours of operation and all the bars and everything so um definitely can expect this when you come on Norwegian. It's great, it's very helpful as you're waiting in the lobby area just to kind of look over and uh, check out and kind of get you more excited for your cruise. It's gonna be absolutely awesome. All right guys, we're officially boarding the Norwegian Bliss. I was on group two and we're about to go up the gangway and uh, embark on this amazing ship, the Norwegian Bliss. I'm so excited. Oh, it's finally time. All right, here we go guys. We're boarding the Norwegian Bliss officially. All right, gonna go to our assembly station, get the safety drill taken care of and then uh, all right, guys, I'm officially born in the gangway. So exciting! Ah, Norwegian Bliss, I'm so excited to be back on you after five years. You know, the three night inaugural I did, that was amazing, but now I can on full seven nights. It's gonna be epic. Here we go. Guys. All right, guys, I'm officially boarded the Norwegian Bliss. Now we're gonna head to the, like I said, muster station, get that all taken care of, and uh, off we go. Hello. All right, guys. First order of business, get my go karting booked, and uh, go from there, right? Gonna grab some lunch at the garden cafe. It's and awesome. it's gonna be Welcome epic home. like this is gonna be awesome and here's the local barn girl hello 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 look at the local barn girl right there guys it's gonna be awesome hello thank you thank you thank you thank you so much right, guys, the local barn girl again this is the atrium area right here check it out got folks coming here look at that beautiful oh yes the most amazing chandelier in my opinion on board any norwegian fleet this is gonna be epic I gotta go down one deck to head to the social. But look how beautiful this is, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love this chandelier. It's so pretty. It's beautiful. 
All right, guys, I got my show reservations taken care of. You got Jersey Boys, Six, a bunch of comedy shows. Uh, some do require reservations, some don't. Uh, but you'll get like a piece of paper when you go to the social, right, when you board the ship, right? But yeah, I'm gonna head over to the Garden Cafe and get some Indian food at Taste of India. My favorite, here we right, go. guys, check this out. Look at this, I love it. Sun's coming out, beautiful day. It's gonna be epic. Oh my God, look at this. Sun's coming out and we're getting ready for an amazing cruise. This is gonna be epic. Guys, here I am. Check it out. It's beautiful. My shit, my uh, glasses are transition glasses. They're probably turning to shades right now. And uh, I'm gonna grab some food, grab some drinks, go put my stuff away in the room, and uh, get ready for an amazing YouTube live. And again, and this is gonna be posted after I get back. But shout out to everyone who made it for my YouTube live as well on Sailor Boy Day from Seattle. I love it guys. I appreciate you guys and all your support. Alright guys, I'm in the Garden Cafe and of course I had to come get my taste of Indian. I got some papadum, some vegetable curry, some rice and balls, some raita, and some other mixed vegetable curry as well. So again, first meal on the cruise has to be Indian food because I love my Indian food guys. This is going to be an amazing start. Have this and I'll get some dessert, get some drinks and hey, it's going to be bon voyage for sure. And here's the chutney drenched. Them <laughs> with some vegetable curry, mixed curry vegetables, some rice, and some dal, and some uh, raita. It's a delicious meal. And again, check out my view, guys. I'm looking, I'm at the right above the observation lounge right here. It's the observation lounge. We're at the very front of the ship, and you can see here as we look out into the future sound, you got two ships back there. You got the Royal Princess and one of the Holland America ships. Yeah, this is awesome, and then we're gonna sail away from Seattle at 5 p.m. and it's gonna be amazing. The sun is coming out, which is lovely. All right, guys, check out this welcome on board cake. Norwegian Bliss looks awesome. We're in the Garden Cafe Buffet. It's a madhouse, but it's awesome. all right, guys. My first drink of the cruise is my favorite mudslide. Norwegian does mudslides the best. They use real ice cream, and it's absolutely delicious. Yo, guys, cheers to an amazing cruise to Alaska. It's gonna be epic. I got my mudslide right here. One of my favorite drinks off of Norwegian, they do the mudslide right, like I mentioned. They use real ice cream, it's absolutely delicious. Here we go, guys. Cheers. Hey, guys. Just had an amazing lunch at Taste of India at the Garden Cafe Buffet. It was amazing. Then I had some pistachio ice cream, and then, of course, I had to get my mudslide. It was my favorite Norwegian drink when I board the ship, right? It's absolutely amazing. They use real ice cream, which other cruise lines don't, surprisingly, but it was delicious. And as you can see here behind me, it's embarkation day. Uh, it's turning out to be a beautiful day here in Seattle. It's going to be about 75 degrees and uh, it's going to be an amazing sail away, guys. I'm so excited. Uh, it's perfect weather as we head up to Alaska and I'm excited to take you guys along for the journey. So here we go, guys. Let's go check out the pool. Right, guys, here's a view of the pool deck. Again, embarkation day. Very lively, very exciting. People are having a good time, had a nice lunch. The drinks are flowing. The music is pumping, as you can see. And here you got Seattle in the background. It's hard to tell, but Space Needle's over there. And it's just a, turned out to be a beautiful day. Look at that, all the clouds are gone. Like, it was so cloudy this morning and now it's all like clearing up and it's made a beautiful sail away. I can feel it. Oh man, this is gonna be awesome. Look at that. People are doing well, having fun in the pool. The water slides are open. Uh, both of them, you got ocean loops right there and then you have the aqua racer right there. Check it out guys, this is awesome. Talk about a perfect, perfect day here in Seattle. And of course you have the kids area right there. I mean, just look at this, look at the vibe. Like, it's seriously, everyone's excited, everyone's having a good time. And it's gonna be an awesome experience, guys. I love it. And I am so excited for you guys to experience it with me. Woohoo, let's do All it. All right, here's the splash zone at the Kids Aqua Park. We got the bucket that's gonna drop here in just a second. Look at this fun area. Oh my God, that's gonna be a big splash for that kiddo right there. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, it's coming. Got a little cool breeze here today, but uh, you know, it's, about, it's gonna be about 70, 75, right? So uh, it should be not too cold, but it'll be fun. Got some flashes right there. Oh, here it comes. It's tilting. I see it moving. Oh, oh, there it goes. And there it goes. In three, two, one, zero. Oh, that's a lot of water. Oh, wow. That was awesome. Ooh, look at that guys. That so hey guys, so it's about 4 p.m. here on Saturday, June 24th, 2023, and it's been an amazing first few hours on board. And now I'm getting ready for my first YouTube live, sailing away from beautiful Seattle. You can see the space over there in just a second. But yeah, it's gonna be amazing. I'm gonna grab a drink here and we're gonna have a great time. So uh, here we go, guys. An amazing seven night cruise to Alaska. Here we go. See my beautiful hometown, Seattle skyline. Got a space needle right there, as you can see. They're getting ready to. Well, it's about an hour away until sail away, but it's gonna be beautiful. You can see they're just getting a few things taken care of.
Hey guys, we have officially left Seattle. Again, shout out to everyone who came out for my YouTube live. If you want to see the people sail away from Seattle, my hometown, definitely check out the live from Norwegian Bliss Sail Away. It was about an hour long. And as you can see here, we have left Seattle. And of course, um, this is the Puget Sound area. We have a beautiful best view, big view, best view. And we have Mount Rainier in the background right there, guys. It's absolutely beautiful. What I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna show you some other perspective as well. This amazing sail away. There's no sail away like Seattle, guys. I kid you not. It's absolutely beautiful. If you're not cruise to Alaska, you gotta do it. You will love it, and hopefully you get a lucky with an amazing, beautiful, sunny day like today, and uh, you'll have an amazing time. I guarantee it. All right, guys. Here we go. Right before I head to dinner at the Manhattan Room, I'm gonna show you this beautiful wake view, best view. Again, shout out to everyone who came out for my YouTube live for about an hour. It was awesome. Had a great experience with you guys as always. And there's my beautiful hometown, Seattle. Okay, the city skyline is saying goodbye. And of course, the main attraction, Mount Rainier. Looking pretty as ever. It is the tallest active volcano in the United States of America. Standing at 14,000 feet. And you can see it for a long time. And what I'm gonna try to do, that's the one thing I always recommend is to folks, is you see all the mountains in the background right there, right? That is the Cascade Mountain Range. Over here, you have the Olympic Mountain Range. And as we go to the north, you see Mount Baker. I'm actually gonna show that to you in a second as well. How beautiful this is, guys. Just listen to the sounds. Shout out to everyone who came out to my YouTube live today. It was epic. It was an amazing hour of fun. As you can see, it's probably a little windy, but I'm just, uh, sorry, I'm close up there. But it looks absolutely beautiful. Um, yeah. yeah, this is amazing. Like, it's a little watch, really windy here. But look at this view. This is epic. Isn't that pretty? Let me actually go over here. It might be a little less wind. Okay, that's better. Hey guys, here we are. I'm actually just outside of Cagney Steakhouse. Oh, it feels nice to be in the sun. It got a little chilly. You know, but cruise here, I don't care. Uh, but it was a lot of fun. Appreciate you guys coming out. It was fun. Like I said, you know, the drink was great. The Bahama Mama. Uh, that went by so quick as we you know, started at 4:30 and then we slowly sailed away from Seattle. But it was a lot of fun. So uh, appreciate you guys coming out. I'm gonna head to dinner at the Manhattan Room and I'll uh, let you guys know about that experience. We're gonna get a fun evening here as well. Uh, my first official, you know, cruise as a full-time YouTuber and uh, a lot of fun ahead as well. So stay tuned, lots uh, so of stuff coming from JT. Here we go. Here's a beautiful view of the sparkling sun and the beautiful waters as we look towards the Olympic Mountains here in the lovely Pacific Northwest as we stay away from Seattle. Love it. The Mount Rainier has disappeared as I showed you earlier. It's amazing. There's the lake here right there and I saw head over here you see the one thing I love about uh, the waterfront is that the outdoor seating now it gets me a little windy here but it's a great place to come and actually enjoy a nice meal especially if you're in the Caribbean where it's not like super windy hopefully if you're not too, going too fast but it's way nice you can see here this way right, it's getting a little windy so part of my voice <laughs> this is beautiful guys look at that you got folks going on the water slides right there 
this is like gonna be an amazing evening guys like the sunset doesn't set till like after 9 p.m but this is awesome the only thing that's really cool about norwegian cruise line is they actually have these fishies that actually swim towards the front of the ship so if you're ever wondering am i going the right way towards your room or anywhere else you need to go just want to take a look at the carpet and then you'll see if you're the fish swim towards the front of the ship pretty cool all right guys check out this beautiful chandelier i love this again i mentioned this before but this is my favorite chandelier on any breakaway plus class ship by norwegian changes colors looks like it's right now just red but it's absolutely beautiful i mean this is gorgeous all right guys so for the first night dinner at the manhattan room i'm gonna get a bruschetta i'm gonna get a cream of cauliflower soup I'm gonna get a vegetable burrito and then for dessert i think it's gonna be a later menu but uh, yeah this is gonna be an amazing start to my norwegian bliss cruise can't wait hey guys cruising with jt here and i'm here at the manhattan room on my first night of the norwegian bliss cruise to alaska again today is june 24th 2023 and i'm here for the first dining experience and i'm excited to have amazing menu selections and i'll show you guys in just a bit but i got the bruschetta Got the cauliflower soup, cream of cauliflower soup, and a vegetable burrito. So as they come out, I'll bring them. I'll show you guys the footage. And again, the menu is amazing, as I showed you guys. Um, this is an amazing space, and uh, you see the actual menu is going. But yeah, it's a pretty busy right now. It's about 6:30 p.m. on uh, first night of the cruise. Again, it's very busy. I had an amazing life. Thanks to you. Shout out to everyone that came out today. It was wonderful. But I mean, I'm excited to have a great meal and uh, share with you guys. Thanks for being here today. We really appreciate it. You see here, I'm charging my phone. I'm on table 104, and we got the beautiful view right there. It's hard to see, but uh, we see the beautiful venue here. Very busy for dinner. The Manhattan room. I'm about 30 minutes late, but that's okay. Yeah, it's gonna be an amazing meal. All right, to start off our meal tonight, we got this delicious bread. We got a nice little artisan bread here. We got some crunchy bread and some other goodness right there. And of course, we have our butter right there. And this is just the start of the meal, guys. Gonna get an amazing bruschetta, cream of cauliflower soup, and of course, a vegetable burrito. So I'm super hungry. This is gonna be delicious. All right, so the first appetizer is this cream of cauliflower soup. Looks absolutely delicious. Look at that, guys. The quality and uh, it's this amazing soup. I've had this before and it's absolutely delicious. Gotta love it. All right, so for my second appetizer, I got this amazing bruschetta. World class. Look at that deliciousness. It's amazing. That cauliflower soup was a, so good. And now we're gonna get some amazing bruschetta. It's delicious. Hey guys, I just wanna say that the service has been so quick tonight and I'm, I'm so low, but I mean, I got my bread, the butter, my cream of cauliflower soup, the bruschetta, and my vegetable burrito, which I'll show you guys in a second, really, really quick. So I'm very impressed. You know, I've heard some uh, recent feedback from other cruisers on different Facebook groups and uh, cruise committee sites that the Norwegian service has been kind of slow, like it takes an hour and a half, two hours. And again, I think it probably varies based on the party size, but based on also the restaurant you go on. Of course, I'm in the Manhattan room today, and there's also taste and savor, which have taken a little bit longer. But the great thing is I've gotten my food so quickly, it's been like 30 minutes and I've had my appetizers and I'm having my entree here in just a second. So of course I'll get dessert. So I might be out here, out of here in like an hour, hour and a half, which is really amazing. So kudos to Norwegian. Thank you so much for taking care of me and uh, I love it. The food is delicious. Oh my gosh, here we go. All right guys, as mentioned, here's the vegetable burrito. Look at that. Look at that burrito and look at that pepper. Oh my goodness. That's gonna be delicious. Do you guys like spicy food? I'm not much of a spicy food eater, but you know, I'm gonna try a bite or two of this one and see how it tastes. And then uh, that burrito looks amazing with the rice and the black beans on the side. Yum yum in my tum tum. Here we go. You guys just want to mention that's been an amazing dinner experience so far. Uh, the service has been really quick. I'm actually really amazed and surprised at how fast the food has come out because, um, again, like I mentioned earlier, like it's been slow service for the most part in different dining rooms, like savor, taste, which I'm actually not gonna go to this week. I'm actually only going to the Manhattan room if I decide to stay in the dining room. Tomorrow I have a Los Lobos. But I, uh, you know, if I, if I decide not to go to the main dining room based on, you know, Manhattan room, based on the menu options, I might just go to the buffet and keep it simple, right? So, yeah, it's very loud here. Sorry, guys. Like, it's like craziness over there. <laughs> um, yeah, this place is hopping, guys. Like, it's been an amazing first day. 
I feel like a lot of energy, a lot of excitement. People are having a great time. The sailor was beautiful. Again, shout out to everyone for that came out to my YouTube live. That was awesome. Now you can check out my live replay on demand. And uh, yeah, it's been a, it's an awesome, awesome first day. Wow. I had the time of my life, guys. I love Norwegian Bliss and oh, this is, this is, this is the best. I love it. Oh my gosh. I can't believe uh, that I'm doing this for a living and thanks to you guys. And uh, just having a wonderful time bringing content to you guys and uh, having an awesome time. So thank you so much, guys. Do the best. Hey guys, JT again. Uh, I just want to let you know that it's been under an hour and I've already finished my appetizers, two of them, entree. Got a set of salsa and the bread and butter and everything is amazing. Now I'm gonna wait for my dinner, or sorry, my dessert. <laughs> and yeah, here's the dessert menu for tonight. What shall I get? Oh. All right, I think I'm gonna get the warm chocolate lava cake. That sounds amazing. Strawberry shortcake sounds pretty good too, but the chocolate, I'm all over the chocolate lava cake. It sounds so good. And stradicella, oh my gosh. Yes. All right guys, my dessert has officially arrived. This is the chocolate lava cake, the warm chocolate lava cake to be clear. Um, this is a nice little chocolate lava cake there with the strawberries, with some syrup there, and the stradicella ice cream. It's absolutely delicious. Mm. Getting hungry yet? Yummy, yummy, tummy, tummy. Guys, I just had an amazing dinner in the Manhattan room and I gotta say, I am stuffed. I'm so full, like, the bread was amazing, the butter, the cream of cauliflower soup, the bruschetta was amazing, the vegetable burrito was amazing with the rice and the black beans on the side along with that spicy green, that, that green pepper. And then the, the, the dessert was absolutely delicious. The warm chocolate lava cake, which you guys just saw amazing with the stradicella ice cream wow that was absolutely epic now i'm gonna have to walk it off and uh, i'm actually gonna head to the internet desk area because i'm having some issues with my wi-fi internet i can't connect to the wi-fi so hopefully i can get that fixed and then i can you know go online and start you know sharing more stuff and hopefully i, I need it obviously because i can try to go live every day if i can so um yeah excellent dinner thank you to region for a wonderful evening uh meal and uh, of course i'm gonna go to some shows later and then I'm gonna maybe get a late late night eat as a, at the local bar and grill maybe some fries and some stuff so but yeah awesome first day guys hope you're enjoying it. hope you're enjoying this uh, first vlog and uh, it's been an awesome experience see here the theme of the night today on this beautiful chandelier is red and orange look at that it's beautiful and of course, this is the main 678 place. Of course, here we have Coco's, which is a specialty uh, dessert area. I'm definitely gonna try some amazing uh, treats here. Look at that gentleman right there. And I'm just gonna zoom in real quick. Oh, wow, look at that. That's a big dessert right there. <laughs> Got something amazing. I might have to try one of those. And then we're gonna head to the atrium. Again, there's a lot of activities and stuff going on over here. And uh, like I said, I'm gonna head to the internet desk because I gotta check out what's going on with my internet connection because it's not working. But um, yeah, this is a very, this is like the heart of the ship right here, guys. You got the atrium bar. You got a gentleman right here. Very nice. Look at that. Lots of stuff happening here. I'm gonna head with the internet cafe. This is epic. And there's a lot of fun stuff that happens here at night, too. So it's gonna be an exciting first Yeah, hey it's been an amazing first evening. Like after dinner, I walked around to digest. I went back to my room to get my phone charged, changed. It's really cold outside, and I wanted to go take some video of the sunset. So, um, again, the, the first man is always busy, he's hopping, everyone's having a great time, great dinner, the music's are wonderful, the lounges are hopping, the drinks are flowing, like you mentioned, you know, like I mentioned, the music is great. So, yeah, I'm gonna head up to the waterfront and take some footage of the, the sunset. So, here we go. Here we go. One of my favorite quotes of all time. The elevator to success is closed, but the stairs are open. Here we go, check it out. So now we're going to deck six into deck, this is deck seven. And then now, once the, so the casino is closed right now because we're not international waters yet. But once we do, they'll open it. And now we're gonna go up to deck eight. Here we go. Da, 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 da. Check it out. I love the chandelier, like seriously, my favorite. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. All right, let's keep walking. Of course, the sugarcane mojito bar is hopping right now. Lots of fun things happening tonight. And uh, yeah, let's go check out the sunset. You guys can see that the shops are busy tonight. Both trying to get their duty-free shopping on. Uh, it's pretty nice though. 
Yeah, so this is it's, it's been really busy. There's a lot of fo folks on this cruise. It's fully sold out, but it's been awesome. I love seeing it. Guys, here we are getting ready for a beautiful sunset, like I mentioned. I mean, this is like, we're uh, heading out into the Pacific Ocean. We're leaving mainland Washington, and uh, this is gonna be beautiful, gorgeous, uh, nothing like a Pacific Ocean sunset, right? So here we go, let's check it. Pardon the wind, guys. It's very windy here. You can see there's some rough seas. Uh, but look how beautiful this is. I'm gonna see if I can stay in front of this uh, wall here. I hope so. Yeah, isn't that beautiful? Bad. There's a smaller boat out there. It's so pretty. Oh, this is nice. About 20 minutes till sunset. It sets at 9 11. It's gonna be amazing. Look at that boat right there. It's like dodging some serious waves. I've never seen a boat before. It's a wild like, oh my goodness. It's very windy out here. There's definitely some rough seas. It's beautiful. It's a little windy, but yeah, this is beautiful. It's like, it's like the, the, the sky is turning pink by the second, and I mean, it's definitely a little bit of a rough seas a little bit. As you can see by that boat over there. And again, this is like, this is basically, you know, but, uh, we're heading out to sea from mainland Washington state. Wow. Oh yeah, this is gonna be cool too. One thing that's really nice about the bliss and the waterfront on that gate here is that it obviously stretches all the way across, right? So you can see it. Um, yeah. But people out here having a good time enjoying the sunset. <laughs> this is nice. Very chilly though. You look very carefully, you can see that the ship is turning. You can see how we're turning to the left. It's pretty cool. Oh, it's cold. I'm so glad I went back and got my jacket. <laughs> oh my goodness. It is cold. And we're moving at a pretty good speed too. I mean, it's not, you know. There's definitely some rough seas, but I'm gonna show you guys. Again, it's gonna get really windy here, guys, but again, for the sunset, that's what it is. Here we go. Look at that. Alright, guys, the sun is setting in, I think, about a minute or two. Again, very windy, apologies, but it's really windy out here today. It's freezing, but it's totally worth it to see this amazing phenomenon, the sunset. You gotta love it, guys. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. Oh my goodness. That's amazing. As the sun goes down. Oh my gosh. I love it. Look at the colors. I mean, like, seriously, like, it's amazing. It just, like, lights up the sky. Less than a minute. There it goes. Oh my gosh, look at it. Let me zoom in a little bit. There you go. Alright, it's gonna go away in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 3, 2, 1. And it's almost gone. <laughs> And there it goes. Officially behind the clouds and the sun has officially set. Beautiful. Now look at the colors. I mean, this is like, now they're going to really pop. I mean, it's beautiful. Look at this, guys. How pretty is this? Wow, so pretty. at the front of the ship and just listen to the sounds. Can you hear that? Some serious
serious waves. This door is like... Sunset tonight. First night of cruise, and again, gotta enjoy this one because it's gonna be cloudy and raining in Alaska, so gotta enjoy this while we can. Oh, look at this. Alright, I'm gonna wrap it up. Hey guys, uh, what a beautiful sunset. Uh, you can see cruise here, I don't care. Oh my gosh. Um, it's really cold and freezing out here right now, but it was awesome to see the sunset. Beautiful. Again, uh, I need a sunset with you. comedy show and uh, people are having some good food it's getting really busy here but uh, it's awesome great way to great first night lots happening I, love I just it. want to mention that uh, the ship's moving a little bit I don't know if you can hear the creaking noise let me go over here I might be able to hear it maybe from on this side do you guys hear that yeah a little bit of rough seas tonight but it's not too bad I just you know, hearing the noise quite often, but uh, yeah, it should be interesting to see how it goes overnight. <laughs> Alright, have a good night. Hey guys, Cruising with JT here, and I'm going to wind down my first night on board the beautiful Norwegian Bliss. It's about midnight on Saturday, June 24th, or 25th now. Um, it's been a wonderful day, uh, great time, great hanging out with you guys um, during the, the live. It was awesome. I'm, I'm actually pretty tired. Uh, usually I don't go to bed till like 1 or 2 a.m. and I'm just super tired because I woke up super early. But uh, hey, you know what? Tomorrow's our first sea day, so I'm going to sleep in a little bit. Got a Got a meet and greet with some Facebook friends, like uh, our cruise group folks, and then um, you know got uh, you know another show and some other a nice specialty restaurant as well at Los Lobos. So stay tuned for that. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this first day vlog. Hit the like button and subscribe if you aren't already, guys. Appreciate your support. And uh, day two vlog, see day. It's gonna come soon. Until next time, guys. This is Cruising JT, and have a good night. And we'll see you soon. Take care. And a cool perspective. Of the very cold and it's starting to rain actually so I'm gonna take cover. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you guys this perspective of the beautiful sea at night. Completely dark. Uh, it's just us in the ocean. Alright guys, until next time this is Cruzy with JT. Have a great night. And a special shout out to all my Patreon and YouTube members. Thank you so much for your additional support. If you'd like to become a Patreon or YouTube member, I'll include the links in the description below. It's basically a behind the scenes view of Cruising with JT and special access to various benefits and perks and inside information into my upcoming videos. So if you do decide to join, I truly appreciate your support. This video is sponsored by MEI Travel. Feel free to reach out to me at cruisingwithjt at gmail.com and I'll get you connected to my travel agent at MEI Travel. She'll take great care of you. And I'll also include the information in the description below. Thank you so much.